This is called a tribute to our veterans. A tribute to our veterans is a special artwork that I created to honor our servicemen and women who have fought and died in these recent 21st century wars. Being a veteran myself and served six years in the Army, I feel it's my duty to honor and show the faces of our falling heroes and the tragedy of wars. The collage of photos on either side of the flag consists of the combined total of 6,912 servicemen and women who gave up their lives in these controversial wars. The centerpiece is a reenactment of a sculpture titled Pieta uh, by a Renaissance artist named Michelangelo. Uh, unlike Michelangelo's religious sculpture of Mother Mary holding in her arms her dead son Jesus, my Pieta consists of a mother wearing anti-war button pins, dressed in black, mourning her son or daughter in her arms. It is said that Michelangelo only signed one sculpture in his lifetime, and it was a Pieta. I signed my work by using my own military uniform, which holds my last name on the right hand pocket. It's Italian. I see it up there. I filmed it in Gallardo, I think it is. I, let's see, I used a skeleton because it could either be a boy or a girl. The helicopter was given to me by an anonymous person. It was placed on top of one of my artworks. The kids had to discover that was a tribute to the September 11th victims. This person, whoever they are, gave me the idea to use it on this project and incorporated the clouds with it. As faith has it in the military, I was an air traffic controller, and the helicopter has army written on it, which is the branch of the military that I served in. On the helicopter, I have a soldier holding an American flag with a peace sign on it. No soldier wants to go to war because for the right reason and truth, many brave men and women are willing to give up their lives for this beautiful flag and for what it really stands for. Now, you see the details. And I say, I, I, my salute to all those people who died in these needless, stupid wars in Iraq. The wars of the 21st century. And good for Mr. Gallardi, G-E-L-A-R-D-I.